child, Lil Dirk just got the key to the city, to Chicago, and they done revoked it. But I think that's the least of his words because that key ain't gonna do shit for him while he's sitting in jail. Hey guys, welcome back to It Girl Uncensored. It's your girl Cecily, the pop culture It Girl, and I'm back with another video. And we're about to get into some things, but before we do, and I'm back with it. I'm back with the nails. Before we get into it, I need you guys to go ahead and like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you all for subscribing. I appreciate you all. We done hit our goal. We done passed 500. So now we're on the road to 1,000. So I need you guys to like, subscribe, comment, and share with your friends. And let's get into it, okay? Because we're growing every single day. Because period. Y'all, this video is not going to be that long because I'm going to get straight to the point. Little Dirk is in jail. The feds done got him for murder to hire. Now, I am... This is a lot of gang and street shit, okay? I'm going to try my best to give y'all what i heard what i read and what my homeboy wrote down to me so we can make it make sense because i'm just i can't apparently Lil dirk was avenging king von who was killed some years ago death okay that's his best friend it was a murder to hire so Lil dirk hired some guys to take out Quando. Is it Quando Hondo? Or Quando Rondo, right? Quando Rondo. They got the cousin. So, Quando Rondo didn't get got. He was in the car, but the cousin got got. So, they didn't get the right person. They got somebody, but not the right person. From what I'm understanding, Quando is not even the person who actually pulled the trigger on king von but his homeboy what's the homeboy name is it sim what it's another guy who actually pulled the trigger now they did get him a little bit because they said he was on a on a shit bag but he hiding they don't know where he at so they was that's kwando's friend are y'all following so king von there was a fight he fighting with the kwando guy Correct me if I'm wrong, I'm just going off of the dome and what I was told. The streets went and got old boy who got him, but not all the way. So now they at the Quando. So now Lil Dirk hired some guys who messed it up because not only did they not get Quando, but they used a credit card. They used they got a rental car. It got connected back to Lil Dirk. That's not the worst of the story. Somebody in OTF, his homeboy Jam, is the one who snitched on him jam been wearing a wire for two to three years jam was in jail or prison for 12 years for a murder to hire as well but he got out and i'm assuming that he got off be so he in exchange for one of the members of otf which ended up being little dirk i don't know was it little dirk like directly but he got out early little dirk bought him a house a car gave him 50 vans Held him down just for this man to wear a wire for had the past couple of years. Ain't no telling what's on that tape. Two to three years? Lil Dirk tried to throw off the feds. He was like booking different flights to different countries trying to throw everybody off. And it didn't work. I don't know. Y'all be watching movies too much. Y'all think that, that it didn't work. They got him. And when the feds got you, that means they got something on you. But clearly, old boy, the snitch, been wearing a wire for a couple of years. Because So there's no telling what else is on there. Aside from, you know, Lil Durk probably admitting to crimes. He already admits it in his songs. There was a song that he talked about how, he, you know, I don't want your cousin. I want Quando. Like, he's saying, like, I want the one I paid for. So, Lil Durk is definitely cooked. Now, side note. Okay, now see, this is where this type of drama crosses over to what I like to talk about, the T. Now, they saying Dej Loaf, y'all know Dej Loaf, shout out to Dej Loaf, because I'm in Detroit, and she from Detroit, because period, Dej Loaf used to date Lil Dirt, and then she's supposed to be with a girl, but maybe her and the girl ain't together no more, but she apparently was with, or been hanging around with Lil Dirt, so she had tweeted out Free Mind, like, I don't know, I guess it was around the same time he got arrested and then she took it down and somebody caught her out on it. And then they was just like, girl, we seen that tweet. And little Dej Loaf was like, and I said what I said. Uh, yeah, I'm glad y'all did. Or whatever. It's just like, girl, but you deleted it. So you didn't, it's like, 
If you said what you said, then you should have just kept it up. But I guess him and India is supposed to be still together. Because I know they be breaking up a lot. So, I didn't know that they were back together. They be on and off. They get they just like little baby. And what's the uh, Jada? It's just a little slight scene. Like, oh, Deja Love was over. She said free her man. And she said she said what she said. Okay. So, you know, I don't know what's going on with that. But I'm going to keep y'all posting on that. However... It don't even matter. And we don't need y'all tussling online about this man that ain't getting out. Because let's be very clear, little Dirk is not getting out. Now, my homeboy said, murder to hire. If the person died, that's life. If they got injured in any way, that's 20 years. And then the murder to hire and they didn't get injured at all, that's a good 10. But the somebody else died in the process of the murder to hire. Even, it was, uh, even though it wasn't the one that was supposed to be the one that's murdered so we don't know what that is but for sure he's definitely in there there's no telling what else is on the tapes what irritates me listen y'all i understand a lot of us would never understand or the gang culture and living in the hood and codes and stuff like that i know people were pressing Lil dirk to avenge King Von's death. This gang culture. I, what, what saddens me about it. Is that y'all. You finally make it. Everybody don't get a chance to make it. So when you see people. And like these young black men. Make it out the hood. And they still do gang shit. It's so 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 disheartening. And it's hurtful to see. And it's just like why can't y'all break out of that. But. I'm not from the streets. I understand the streets now. I definitely get it. But if you're still going to be doing gang shit, then wh- why are we not moving smarter? As much movies as you watch, thinking that you about to outsmart the feds by booking flights all over it and trying to throw them off, which what did not work. I would. Th- let me see, I'm not a criminal, okay? I'm not. I just know. That if I am going to take care of something, I am not going to hire anybody else to do it. Listen, I don't encourage anybody to do anything illegal. So I'm not, I'm going on record saying that. Nobody's ever going to be in a position to get me in trouble but myself. If I'm going to be sitting in that jail, it's because I did it. And the ones who you hire is clearly was sloppy and stupid and they made a rookie mistake. And you got got. What is also annoying What be annoying for me is that I'm Lil Durk. I'm sitting in jail. And I ain't even get the one that I hired these fools to take out. You didn't didn't even get the one that you wanted. So what was it all for? Your children is going to grow up without a father. Like it's. Now didn't he have an oldest son that was living with his brother. And he didn't really claim that son until after the brother. Lil Durk's brother died. And ain't this the same little boy who, it was something going on with the, um, the mama. Correct me if I'm wrong. This is them. I didn't, I didn't, I just not thinking about it. Didn't Lil Durk's oldest son shoot his mom's boyfriend because the mom's boyfriend was beating on him? If I'm not mistaken, I believe that's Lil Durk's son. But I also believe that's the same little boy who was raised by Lil Durk's brother. And the only reason why he claims the little boy now is because the brother ain't there. I don't know about none of this. So, you little Dirk fans or whoever, don't cuss me out. None of that. I'm just trying to understand. I'm just giving y'all the information that is out there. And we just talking about it. I just think it's really sad that when you make it out the streets. And then you result to the street shit. You end up just in jail anyway. And it was like, well, it seemed like you were going to go to jail anyway. But you actually had an opportunity to make it out. Why did it have to be you but i also understand that gang culture is looking funny when the people who is responsible for your man's demise you know demise and expiration they look at you like you need to go handle that i get it but at the same time it's stupid it's still stupid and you're still throwing away your life and then this fool i'm curious to know the rat jam who wore the wire how much longer did he have on his sentence? Because he was already serving 12 years from what I'm understanding. But I want to know how long do you have? did you have left? Because for you to go ahead 
And not only were you, I think he was being taken care of in there, but he, he set you up when you got out and you set him up. Crazy work. You do know that I ain't, listen, I ain't God and I ain't psychic, but it doesn't take a genius or rocket science to know that your days are numbered. You do know that, right? So you did all of that to cut your time. Just but your time, you cut your you cut your time in more ways than one, because this is street sh- and this is gang shit. So if everything goes according to code, you ain't gonna be here too much longer because you're a rat. So it's very unfortunate. I feel sorry for everybody involved. Yeah, I know it's sad for Little Dirk because he was in movies. What was that power he was just on? And you just had the key to the city. You was being Muslim for for a minute. I don't know what happened with that. But also, you talk about all of this in your songs. I don't know what state. They have some states where they can't use your songs against you. But it don't matter because there's no telling what's on that. It's the recording. Two to three years? Ain't no telling what you done said. Ooh, wait. Yeah. Ooh wee, the betrayal. And then King Von got a song where he talked about how his homeboy snitched on him. And now he going through the same thing. Y'all, it's sad. Tell me, what do you guys think about that? Like, is there a way where... And fellas, if you're watching. I know I have a, um, a lot of my females watch. But fellas, if you're watching. If he didn't live by that code... And he didn't avenge King Von's death. What would it have done for him in life? Would he just. He had to deal with people making comments. About him not doing anything about it. Or is that it? What happens when you do make it out the hood. And you really disassociate yourself. From gang life. Gang related things. Are you really looked and frowned upon? Is it worth it to still dabble in gang activity. After you made it out the, out the hood? Is it worth it? But to some, especially those in the hood, it is. So it's like, we can sit here and judge and have opinions on it all day. But unless you actually live that life, it's not much you can really do. However, you have, there, everybody has choices. And it just seems to me that you were given an opportunity and you threw it all the way to be doing the same shit you was doing before you was given the opportunity. Therefore, the opportunity was wasted. And then the 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 the, the one that snitched on you, he the dummy because Lil Durk is the money. So you done messed up the money for the whole crew. So if I'm somebody on the team that just eating just because Lil Durk is my friend and now the money is in jail and we know his ass ain't getting out, I'm looking for your ass. And there's no telling who else that got on these tapes. Ooh, baby. Tell me what y'all think about Lil Durk. Tell me what y'all think about him on the age of loaf. You think they was fooling around? You think India's going to hold him down? Shit, it's only a matter of time before she gets snatched up within a year. It's a lot going on, y'all. I'm, I'm so sorry to everybody involved. It's sad, but it is what it is. Being, boy, they locking us up, man. And I don't want to hear... Man, they taking all the rappers down. It's an agenda. Nigga, he he did you did the crime, you about to do the time. Yeah, it's an agenda. Y'all just feeding into it. You're giving them they ain't gotta do much. You're giving them like ammunition to shoot you down. No pun intended. That is all I have to say about that. This is your girl Cecily with Igor Uncensored. Oh child. Lil Dirt. I wouldn't survive in jail. I'll be somebody's bottom bitch quick.